Hello, my name is Cheryl Cattell, and welcome to today's LinkedIn Minute. I'm so glad you joined. Today, we're going to learn about the profile picture and what makes a good one and how to get rid of that pesky background, especially if there's a lot of things going on. Well, to start with, your profile image should reflect the audience that you're trying to speak to. So if your audience dresses up in business suits with ties every day, you should do the same for your profile picture. However, if your audience prefers to wear polo shirts or t-shirts, then it's fine for you to also do the same. So let's assume you have the right clothing and you're going to match your target audience. The next thing you wanna look for is a photo that has 60% of the image on your face. So that's usually a good number. You don't want something where your head is too small or where it's so big it's taking up 100% of the image space. You want to have something to put it in perspective. All right, I do recommend, however, that you spend the money to get a professional headshot. However, because my motto says, timely implementation over delayed perfection, I want to show you how to take an image that may have been taken on an iPhone and remove the background so that it gives you a bit more of a professional touch. All right, to start with, I would right click on the picture and save image as. Okay, so we'll save it here. Then I'd like you to go over to a website and the URL for that website is remove dot b g. I'll say it again, remove dot b g. Then I'd like you to take that profile photo and go ahead and upload it into this website. It will do its little magic and presto bingo, wow, <laughs> you already have your background removed. Now you can choose to put a white or black or a color image behind you, but that's not the point. We came here to get rid of it. So let's just stick with the transparent background. The great thing about this picture is you can now put it on a black background or you can put it in a presentation over an image. You can use this any place where you would like to have your head on top of something, a color or something else. All right, so now we've got it, let's download it and it's got the name of my image with remove. All right, let's hop back on over and now left click on the picture and we want to view or edit our profile. All right, next we are going to add a new photo and we're gonna upload that. And of course we wanna use the one that has the remove BG preview. So let me show you what that looks, voila. In this case, the default background for LinkedIn is black. So you can save it. And now all of the colors, maybe the conflicting colors with your, with your banner have been removed. And as I said before, you can also change it to white. All right, well, that's it for today's LinkedIn Minute. Thanks for stopping by.